Hello friends, welcome to Biology for Engineers, Unit 1, Introduction to Basic Biology, Plant Cell and Animal Cell, Part 1. Plant Cell versus Animal Cells, here is the comparison of plant and animal cells. The cell wall, plastids and a large central vacuole are present only in plant cells, which are absent in animal cells. Whereas, the centrioles are present only in animal cells, which are absent in plant cells. Now, the following cell organelles are present in both plant and animal cells. They are cell membrane, endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi apparatus, lysosomes, mitochondria, ribosomes, and nucleus. This is the structure of plant cell where we can see the cell wall, cell membrane, ribosome, Golgi apparatus, and then uh, chloroplast, mitochondria, nucleus, well defined nucleus, and the nucleolus, and then endoplasmic reticulum, then the cytoplasm, and a large central vacuole are present in the plant cell. This is animal cell. Here we can see the plasma membrane, then Golgi apparatus, ribosomes. Inside the plasma membrane is filled with cytoplasm, then lysosome, mitochondria, the central part of the cell, the nucleus is clearly seen with nucleolus, and centrioles are present, microtubules are present, and endoplasmic reticulum, both rough and smooth endoplasmic reticulum are present here. Next, cell membrane. Cell membrane is present in both plants and animal cells. They are surrounding the cell and composed of lipids and proteins. The function of cell membrane is transport of molecules. Then cell wall. Cell wall are present only in plant cells and they are absent in animal cells. The outer covering for the cell membrane is the cell wall. Cell wall covers the entire cell and gives a protection. So it protects the cell from the mechanical damage and infection. The cell wall helps in cell to cell interaction. Then the endoplasmic reticulum. They are a network of tiny tubular structures scattered in the cytoplasm. Ribosomes are sometimes attached to the outer side of the endoplasmic reticulum. So when the ribosomes are attached, this endoplasmic reticulum is known as rough endoplasmic reticulum. When the ribosomes are not attached with the endoplasmic reticulum and such endoplasmic reticulum is called as smooth endoplasmic reticulum. The function of endoplasmic reticulum is protein synthesis and secretion. Then the Golgi apparatus, they are the reticular structures found near the nucleus. The structure of Golgi apparatus is flat, disc shaped sacs. They are in the sac forms. Then the function of Golgi apparatus is packaging materials for transport across the cell. Then the lysosomes. They are the membrane bound vesicular structures found in the cytoplasm. So these lysosomes are capable of digesting the carbohydrates, proteins, lipids and nucleic acids. So far we have discussed the structure of plant cell, animal cell, cell wall, cell membrane, endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi apparatus and lysosomes in this part 1. Again in part 2, we will discuss the remaining cell organelles. Thank you.